Okay, so hi Aisha, hi Ravi. I'm Sakshi. Um, welcome to Catch Up Talks on Social Catch Up. Thank you. Thank you for having us. <laughs> thank, thank you for being here. Um, before we dwell on to anything, I wanted to first ask, already three episodes in, how are you feeling of the last season three episodes are in? And have you gone through any people's reactions so far? I mean, the b- blessing is that we are on YouTube, so we have all the reactions uh, the moment we release uh, the episode. So, yeah, I like it. I, I, I'm, I, I was actually, I should not say much about that, but uh, since I'm not in season, uh, sorry, uh, third episode, it was exciting to watch something that I, I didn't know how it panned out, but I loved the episode, I think. The tension, the awkwardness, it was great in episode 3. I love it. And, and how was it for you? Um, actually, I was, uh, episode 3 turned out to be a little surprising for me. Um, most of that episode was shot on the first day of my first day of shoot. So, you know, it was uh, it was interesting kind of getting back into it and all of that. And um, uh, I was actually very, very pleasantly surprised. I mean, not to say that I thought it was going to be bad or anything, but I was actually very surprised by how heartwarming that episode turned out to be. Um, uh, there was uh, probably my favorite scene in the in the show. Actually, I've been holding back in interviews from saying this because the episode hadn't released was uh, the scene that I had with um, Sujata Ma'am who plays Nandini and I just felt that um, all those moments came together really beautifully and I've really been enjoying the pacing of this I know that we started out as this sort of fun show that's you know just meant to make people laugh and be light-hearted but I think that there is some genuinely um, beautiful things inbuilt into this show uh, about life and I think it really came out in this episode I really felt that so I feel like this this season I think is something that uh, will be really kind of understood by people once all the episodes are out. You know, some things work well in parts and then some things work well as a whole and I think this is going to be like the latter. So I was really, really um, happy. I saw some of the comments and there was wonderful things that were said about, um, you know, just about adoption. It's It's just something that hasn't really been explored so much in storytelling. Um, and this is not just about adoption, it's about really the fears around parenting and all of those things. But but I also really loved, there were so many people who really responded to that statement about South Indians, mm. you know. And um, I didn't myself realize that, um, th- that this is something that happens and actually, you know, uh, th- th- this is something that people are sort of put out and made to feel and I, I was amazed that just that one dialogue that um, the, the adoption agents dialogue had such a uh, such a reaction so much validation from people that they felt so good that I was put out there you know when he says that there's nothing known as a South Indian there is this there's Kanadiga there's you know I mean there was all of those things and there were lots of people that commented on that and that was really nice like I'm, I'm so glad we addressed that I didn't know that it was something that was going to have that kind of a scale of a reaction. I think that's beautiful about our country, uh, you know, like it's not only about South India, it's also about North India, UP is also North India, Kashmir is also North India, Punjab, Haryana, like you can see the borders of Punjab, how many are different, but when you call them North Indian, they all are one thing, right? Even with yeah. the Northeast, there are many uh, states over there, but we they all are in one, one category. We all are in one category. South India is in one category. So yeah, these are these are things that you don't like probably think about a lot. But when somebody says it in uh, the form of uh, storytelling, you relate to it and you validate it by you know repeating uh, or actually uh, taking the conversation a uh, step ahead. Yeah, I thought I thought that was wonderful, you know, because uh, the character says that there is no such thing as South Indian. There is, yeah. you know, and a recognition of different cultures, and you know, because we tend to generalize, and that's what the Kashi's character does, right? He says that yeah. no South Indian is out there, you know, and yeah. then at that, we there is a reaction from a character. Also, if you think about it, that these people were sitting in a room, uh, they had a moment where you know they discuss adoption etc they have a moment where these characters they come together and they're aligned they're on the same page and then he throws that off by putting that out there so I thought it was nice yeah. that you know, um, 
that this uh, this guy Vikas reacts that way ki aisa kuch hota nahi hai we have many different uh, cultures and we're not clubbed as yeah. one and that uh, he also comes back and says that this is not going to affect the decision that aapki ek joke se ye no is not going to decide the fate of that couple and i think that that was nice that a they, he got called out for doing yeah. that and then that, that he was also forgiven yeah you know But I think, I think know, it, it didn't come like it didn't come from a place where somebody got offended and he started uh, justifying himself that that's not what I meant. Like instead, he just educated him that what you're saying there's no such thing like that, which is nice. Yeah, yeah you're right. And I often think about this. You know, I often think about and honestly, I'd not thought about all these things when we were shooting. Uh, but when you have like we have so much of you know cancel culture going on today, right? That if someone says something wrong, does something wrong, they just cancel. Mm. Um, and it's almost like with you know very often i find that people just sort of have opinions because we know all the right opinions to have we know all the woke yeah. opinions to have. we don't always consider where we're coming from that are we actually are we actually there yet like maybe we want to yeah. get there but are, and i don't believe in cancel culture because i think that saying that only the people who already agree with me are allowed to be here you know so yeah. i really enjoy i think uh, and i was kind of amazed by this episode that all these things were happening and i didn't even realize that i was there i was physically there on that shoot it's only when i saw the episode that i was like that this is the way to actually deal with these things you educate and then you forgive and move on you know um how can some better when they don't know yeah i thought that was uh, that was something that was really nice and that meant something to me sorry was that longer maybe that was a longer no answer. no 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 i no. was detailed <laughs> Yeah, I think that's what interviews are for. Now we kind of want to know what what you think as well. Yeah. We yeah. just don't want to see Nikhil and Anita. We want to see Aisha and Veer as well. Okay. Yeah. So I want to ask. I show my family this show. So does your family also watch this show? No. And what yeah. are their reactions? मेरे तो देखते हैं यार मेरे तो मतलब दोस्तों के families भी देखते हैं. I have someone living. Uh, in us who's a childhood friend wo apne in laws ke sath dekhte hain they were happy as this time oh my god akshita is back <laughs> in my so, case i yeah. said family group nobody has watched it but very often you know when my parents are out at dinner uh, they'll um, i'll get this uh, very hurried whatsapp from them saying ki uh, somebody was asking where can we see your work you know so what should i tell them so now i have this whatsapp prepared i can send to them with some links <laughs> uh yeah my my family is very bad that way they don't um, they forget uh which kind of uh, brings me to the next question we are in the last week it's kind of a full circle um you know there was it is a full circle was, it is a full circle yeah you know nikhil rang the doorbell of the sharma house and entered the house we started from there and now we are back again to the sharma house having the whole journey yeah. But while we have seen uh, Nikhil and Anita, I want to know how has the journey been for both of them. Yeah, uh, I'm sure you would agree to this. He, मतलब, not that I'm trying to generalize uh, 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 whole surname, but Sharma's are a little, थोड़ा मतलब गुस्सा आता है ना, because ऐसा exemplary चीजें करते रहते हैं. Like you are always reminded of Sharma का बेटा, Sharma की बेटी, ये Sharma uncle and everything. तो मतलब हाँ मुश्किल होता है ट्राई टू बी परफेक्ट इन शर्मा हाउस होल्ड बट आई थिंक वेन यू एंटर अ शर्मा हाउस एंड यू बी देर फॉर लाइक कपल ऑफ डेज और मंथ्स एज दैट वन अंकल सेट ही यहीं बस जाओगे तुम बट एज यू नो देम मोर यू ऑल्सो अंडरस्टैंड कि इतना भी कुछ नहीं है दे ऑल्सो हैव देयर फ्लॉज दे आर ऑल्सो हैज us because as a bachpan se sharma sharma is such a is such a heavy word no that we yeah, aise hi karna padega i'm sure you guys don't like you so definitely not sakshi because you are sharma so ha matlab aise hi hota hai in fact me and isha we used to talk about uh, it you know like normally it's like any other neighbors aapko pata hai kahani ek dysfunctional family hai like uh, uske papa aise hai mummy aisi hai choti behan aisi hai badi behan aisi hai एक दामाद भी है ये भी है तो मतलब सारी चीजें मतलब बहुत कुछ अलग नहीं है बट जैसे जैसे आप घुसते जाते हैं आप थोड़ा उनके हॉल तक जाएंगे आपको थोड़ा डायनामिक समझ में आएंगे बेडरूम तक घुसेंगे गए और डायनामिक जैसे जैसे स्टोरी में घुसते जाएंगे यू नो कोई कोई नई चीजें को रेदी जाती है एंड वो अभी तक वही आई थिंक दैट्स द बेस्ट पार्ट अबाउट द शो एंड आई एम रियली हैप्पी अबाउट दैट 
Ella fue... What your, uh, what the specific of your question, Sakshi, that when you say that, how has the journey been? Because, you know, we've answered this question so many times now. Um, that I want to, uh, I, I want you to give me a different question within this so that we can uh, give you a different answer. That's uh, not why don't answer. we ask you, like, answer it in one word. How has your journey been? See? Sochna bada guys. But one word. I don't know. Your journey. <laughs> <laughs> it's our journey. You also have to say. That's my question, frankly. I mean, I was asking her to ask in one word. What is this? Some autograph book in class seven ki read describe it in one word. Oh, it's amazing. See, <laughs> see, this is also one thing that I think Sharmas have. They won't answer it. They will find the problem in your question. The question is wrong. They will answer it. We will see it in the next video. First, let's solve your question. For a more specific question, um, that so I can answer. Okay. That. Um, how has your journey as um, Aisha been with Anita? Okay. Uh, firstly, kind of teacher, um, and um, been. Okay, I have actually I really love this character. Um, I genuinely really love this character because I think. Um, so and uh, specifically vis a vis me, what playing this character did for me. Um, It was, I think, the first time that I, as an actor, explored comedy, which was really meaningful. You know, I frankly consider myself very funny. So um, it's 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 very fun when you can actually bring that out. Um, it, you know, it, it's and I don't often get those kinds of roles. You know, like I often get sort of cast in this sort of like uh, strong girl. You know, like sort of smart girl, this that. So I, I get these very no nonsense characters most of the time. And um, it was though she is actually a no-nonsense character, but when put in that comedy sort of setting, you work a lot with timing, and um, it was really uh, fun for me to start exploring that. Secondly, the kind of freedom we got on the show is not normal in our line of work. You know, we have to sort of just pretend that we are like these vessels and we do bring what we are told. But we've gotten a lot of freedom, a lot of play uh, actors in this show. Specifically for me, I would say in the last four or five years, what happened, right, is that, um, uh, and this is partly out of like just from social media, is that um, I realized that the character that was put out there is this woman. She was older than her husband, more successful than her husband. You know, she's not your typical eye candy at all. Like today, now in like this web world and all our OTT stuff, like now a lot of women are put out there like that because again, it's like that book. Opinion, you already know what you have to say. So there's everything is female centric. Everything is, you know, they're ticking those boxes. But uh, I do believe that we were one of the first um, web shows out there who actually um, had a female take, uh, which was actually empowering. And um, it was a response from that, from social, which I, we got on social media, and I realized that how many girls out there were so positively affected by Anita, you know, mm. and. They'll come to me. Um, it's not, and it's not just me because I don't think I created her alone, right? Like I just played her. But uh, everyone, like, say that even the way we played Nick Hill, the it's not like it's not that Anita was just this like very successful, upstanding woman who stands for herself. There's also like a guy out there who's just not affected by her success or her strength, you know. Uh, it was something that was just sort of taken in the stride. This this wasn't a thing about a man who was threatened by his wife's. Stature or this or that. It was someone who was just very cool with it and who like really supported her and loved her for it. And I think that um, so a lot of that. And I think you know whether it's the way they stood up to their parents or just the things that moved on in their lives. The relationship has so much fun and like they're like buddies, right? They're like high school buddies. Like they, I always think of their relationship as like two kids who were like made to sit on like class partners or your desk with each other. Like that. Like I always think of it like that. And that. You have this like love hate thing going on with them, but you basically like are really happy to sit next to each other every day. So, um, but so I do realize that like you know a lot of everyone's work went into creating this character and also developing this character. But I realized only over the years how this character has really um, changed a lot of the ways a lot of the girls out there see themselves and how they feel like they should be. And the fact that like there is a relatability, you feel like he can like I can also do this. Like when you see that okay, like some character that I aspire to or that I admire can say something like this, like can stand up to their parents or can be this person, then it makes you feel like okay, I can also be this person. And um, yeah. I'm so 
so happy you know honestly like the scale of the show started out as a really small show and it's still a small show but it has just had such a impact on so many people uh, you know i mean it's still it's a youtube show it's still a show on youtube 5 years later right it still got the same five cast members a core family um it's still five six episodes you know but um i have seen how uh, the impact that how it's helped people it's carried people through i've seen people who are telling me that they were fighting with their families and then they just sat down and watched this and then they fell back in love with each other couples that were you know sort of going through issues they saw nikhil and neeta make up and then they you know so i know that it's somewhere this show has had a very um it's just touched people's hearts simply because you know it's not it's not like it doesn't show problems but it kind of always has this thing that that love pervades those problems and um so yeah i think that that is meant that's been my journey with it, that sometimes simple honest storytelling can actually make an impact on people and definitely the way it impacted the girls and women that watched this character that was that really meant a lot to me um it kind of brings me to one next question as well um you said there is you got to do humor and there mm-hmm. were serious topics as well and kind of what we also said the same thing there is so much tonality you uh, see in the show as actors i kind of want to understand the process how do you manage between doing humor as well and then get to the serious point as well see that's the scene yet maintain the balance See, but that's the scene. We don't come there on the same day and uh, do the entire show, right? Uh, we uh, in a day we might do two or three scenes. So you, play, you know, you a to like you're not playing everything at the same time. It's like saying that as a, you know, like um, you're a mother, you're a daughter, you're a, you know, you're a worker, you're a this, you're a that. How do you do it all? The answer is you're not doing all those things at all times, right? um you're not you're not everything that you are at every given moment um but i think that um, that balance comes it's it's like what we do is we put out the there is a script we're given a scene and i think that what the actor can bring to a scene is that um that's different that say that what i can bring to a scene versus what we can bring to a scene what another one can bring is that how do we read what's in between the lines you know um how can we what can we find because the lines are the lines you know uh, what the writers trying to do is obvious or it should be but what can we bring there that kind of digs a little bit deeper and as me as a human being you have you have the range of emotion that a human being has right so our job is just basic put that out there on a screen so in your life you must be managing humor drama this that right so we all do it it's just that our job is whatever we we just tune into what we feel and put it out as opposed to maybe someone who has a different job there's nothing an actor human being doesn't do you know other than that they, they do it on camera or on a stage did you want to answer that as well so the, the uh, balance of drama i'll tell you i'll tell you uh, how it happened uh, in season 1 right season 1 we were uh, uh, working with senior actors and there were a lot of uh, like the basic uh, uh, context of season 1 was to uh, create comedy right in an awkward situation or an unusual uh, situation and then we got on to uh, season 2 where we were talking about uh, um childhood separation anxiety or you know uh, a woman trying to uh, like having complete freedom with their parents where they she can fight them and you can you know, she can bring them down to uh, you know one simple logic that you know you don't do not underline the fact that is a taboo like you know you understand it like the age gap doesn't matter to us so you don't underline it whereas the same person going to her in law she's not like she's not like aisa ki dar gayi ya fir you know nervous hai kuch bhi nahi hai she just like trying too hard to make it perfect you know trying too hard to make some sense of it so find trying to find some comfort in it and ab in cheezon mein humne humor kaise nikala ya fir even season 4 uh, jahan pe jo aap abhi dekh rahe ho un cheezon mein it's actually to think of it it's in our skin somewhere 
बिकॉज आई टेल यू देर इज दिस सीन आप ऑलरेडी वो सीन देख चुके हैं एपिसोड टू से जहाँ पे निखिल अनिता अक्षता और ये भाई साहब बैठे हैं इनके जो नए वो है क्या नाम है रवजीत का इसमें तो ये चार लोग बैठे हैं एंड शी हैज टू से समथिंग अबाउट बुलिंग और यू नो समथिंग एंड कुछ तो भी ऐसे बोलते हैं कि पापा यूजुअल से ज्यादा वो कर रहे थे क्या एंड सम हाउ आई आई वाज सिटिंग सॉरी द थिंग वाज दैट एज अनीता सेज अक्षय आई हैव टू से यू बिकम क्वाइट अ बुली एंड शी सेज सीखा किस तरह ha huh. and so, then uh, it's not in the script i said uh, runs in the family saath ke saath aise hi matlab nikal gaya runs in the family and wo runs in the family agar wahi waisa rehta na to shayad wo thoda kam real lagta but instantly isha ke muh se nikla you shut up you know to wo matlab humne banaya nahi wo ban gaya wo matlab kisi na kisi tarah se wahan baat pahunch jati hai aur agar wo nahi pahunchti hai then i think Each and every season, each and every scene, when we try to do, uh, there are times when we actually talk to each other, where we decide, you know, here, you can say this, we can say that, or we can do this, we can do that, we can do that. But when we are actually in it, in the scene, she's right. Mostly, it's playing. It's just like you know, सबका अपना contemporary dance चल रहा है कोई इधर से घूम के इधर जा रहा है सीन में कोई इधर जा रहा है but we are still in one, एक मतलब एक symphony है सब में फिर भी So yeah, that's 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 actually how it happens. There's no rocket science. There's no prep. There's no uh, who's going to crack a better joke or oh probably that could be there that who could be uh, cracking a better joke. But the point is that when you're in the scene, you play rather than prepare or you know uh, take it in a certain way. And everybody compliments everybody. Like it's it's never been like कोई एक बीच में से आ गया और एक्टर ने बोला कि यार मुझे ये लाइन्स बोली हुई हैं ये कुछ और बोल रहे हैं because even if I, uh, my scene is with sudha and if i try to improvise something she will answer back as sudha you know matlab koi kisi ko chhodta nahi hai matlab wo kyunki aap har saal karte hain you know but mostly aisa sitcoms mein bhi hota hai ki aapko 3 saal lagte hain writers ko ya 2 saal lagte hain writers ko characters build karne mein episodes banane mein and aap dekhenge dusre teesre saal se all those actors and everything they will also have a lot of input because they are also part of the world and they also have that liberty to take the scene into a different place if they could at all what he yeah. was referred a specific line say about the bullying it like, was actually this whole thing was none of it was written on script it was simple um hamara ravjit aur mera sid aur anita ka kuch right just something that we had to keep talking while these two come back from the kitchen so it was just a ice breaker that like he, uh, let's please me ko akshita says i don't want to listen to any more of this or whatever nerd giri baat ho gayi that was the only line then i said um you become quite a bully now the thing is akshita is not really a bully anita is the bully anita was not originally written as a bully we made her that you know she is not actually there was no character breach that said that she is a bully you know wo ban gaya aur wo because over the years the way veer and i played it it's not like i actually bully him in real life or something you know it's just the way we played these characters that she's not obviously bullying him you know it's just that it's no, she's saying it we are not agreeing on it but yeah, yeah. but i'm just saying that that's the way we played off it so fir usse that's the whole thing that when he says oh runs in the family that's not something that would have come to him say in season 1 you know because yeah hame bhi nahi pata us time pe you know yeah, and then we right. start, it's her being the bully right so it's like a um, these things happen also like you know you also grow with the characters because the character are also getting older na like they've also been around longer now so they also kind yeah. of with you a little bit you have lived the longest with these characters have you found anything annoying within them many like, things it really irritates somewhere to be main gatha likh sakta hu ek puri ek kitab likh sakta hu aur us kitab ke char chapter honge pehla chapter hoga ki ki iske sath initially kya galat tha aur isme kya galat tha फिर आई थिंक आप कोई भी सीजन पकड़ के देख लो मैं अपने कैरेक्टर के लिए बोल सकता हूँ कि किताबें लिखी जा सकती हैं वो रॉन्ग विद दिस गाय बिकॉज मोस्ट ऑफ द टाइम 
वो अपनी करेक्शन के लिए बढ़ता रहता है टूवर्ड्स द एंड कि किसी तरह वो थोड़ा सा बेटर हो जाए थोड़ा सा बेटर कर दे इट्स लाइक अ बॉय लाइक यू नो जो बच्चा होता है छोटा सा पहले रजिस्ट करता रहेगा अरे यार तेरी मम्मी पापा से क्या बात करूंगा यार मैं मुझे नहीं पता एंड देन यू नो ट्राइंग टू मेक सम सेंस ऑफ इट देन दूसरे दूसरी किताब होगी कि अरे यार मेरी बहन के साथ मेरी नहीं बनती यार नो कैसे बात करेंगे यार अरे देन फिर कर लेता है फिर थर्ड सीजन आएगा देन लाइक नहीं चाहिए बच्चा यार नहीं चाहिए बिल्कुल भी नहीं चाहिए एंड देन फिर ढूंढ लेगा बीच में से कोई ना कोई एक चीज पकड़ लेगा एंड यू नो हिल फाइंड मोटिवेशन एंड दिस एंड दिस ऑल्सो तो जब तक आई थिंक सबसे बड़ा निखिल का फ्लॉ है कि वो मतलब अपने आप कुछ नहीं कर सकता उसको अनिता चाहिए चाहे सेम शहर में चाहिए चाहे दूसरे शहर में चाहिए चाहे वीडियो कॉल से चाहिए चाहे कॉल से चाहिए चाहे अपनी बालकनी में बैठ के उसी को बता बताने में भी वो कुछ ना कुछ अपने में एनेबल कर रहा है लाइक उसको समझाने में कि भाई तू अपनी जॉब के बारे में सोच तो अपने घर का लोन दे देंगे कर लेंगे उसको बताते हुए वो खुद बहुत चीजें समझ कर तो मतलब सबसे बड़ा फ्लॉ तो यही है अगर मतलब निखिल को आप किसी आईलैंड में छोड़ दो स्टैंडर्ड बाई हिल डाइन जिफी समथिंग दैट यू लर्न फ्रॉम निखिल आई यू नो आई स्टिल डोंट नो व्हाट व्हाट निखिल डज लाइक व्हाट इज हिज जॉब मुझे अभी तक पता नहीं है आई एम द बॉनी स्टिंसन ऑफ व्हाट द फोक्स लाइक एवरी टाइम यू आस्क मी व्हाट्स योर बिजनेस आई एम जस्ट गोना बी लाइक प्लीज कम ऑन वाओ ओके लेट्स से ओके व्हाट व्हाट अनीता लाइक व्हाट्स अनीताज जॉब प्रोफाइल अनीता इज अ फाइनेंशियल एडवाइजर that's something that you tell kids like you know what do you do at your job i'm a financial advisor what is that about i just go to a cabin speak to people shut my laptop come home <laughs> i i'm sorry i know what anita does anita works in private equity and she advises people on how to handle their personal wealth i actually know what she does yeah yeah that's your job profile for one season <laughs> all right don't don't try to justify that yahi se shuru hua tha yahi khatam hoga <laughs> मुझे पता है मुझे पता है आई हैव लॉन्च आई हैव लॉन्च अ फूड डिलीवरी एप दैट इज नॉट दैट इज नॉट दैट दैट इज डिफरेंट फ्रॉम जोमैटो दैट इज डिफरेंट फ्रॉम स्विगी बिकॉज़ दैट गोस टू द ठेले वाला ऑन द रोड एंड देन दे मेक दैट हाइजीनिक पैकिंग एंड देन डिलीवर इट टू पीपल एंड वी आर मेकिंग अ लॉट ऑफ मनी आउट ऑफ इट यू हैव नो आईडिया अबाउट इट आहा आहा देन यू आर लाइक या आई थिंक चलता रहेगा बट कमिंग बैक टू व्हाट एल्स What is the most annoying thing that you have found with Anita? The annoying thing about Anita that I found uh, Anita has massive control issues. Like she clearly has some very very like a bully. Control. You'd say <laughs> bullies are not about control. Uh, bullies are insecure. That's why they want to take control. That's how they yes. are bullied. So um, I think yeah, she has definitely got like control issues. Uh, she doesn't. Um, I mean, it's not annoying necessarily, but I would say it's a problem that she has that she can't let go of anything. And anything that you have learned from your characters? I've learned a lot of patience from Nikhil. I've learned a lot of. Um, I'll answer for myself. I have learned that uh, you know, keep everything aside and listen. and just like like don't be too serious about life man just like be considerate to people around you be nice and uh, joy is somewhere uh, in the corner of your home if you actually look at it and have you learned something from anita i um, have learned uh, men um, mujhse pooch lo if i have learned anything from <laughs> no no man No, no. This is more interesting. Let's hear what he's learned from Anita. <laughs> I've learned from Anita that I should behave, a, and uh, I should take life seriously, b, and uh, most importantly, that never in my life I can say, oh, I don't know, man. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Like I can't say I don't know. What do you mean you don't know? <laughs> like every time you like you don't know. ऐसा कैसे चलेगा? So I need to know. I need to stand up uh, for myself. I need to have a clear vision of what I'm trying to convey. And uh, yeah, I mean, these are the things. Be the change you wish to see in the world. That's what Anita <laughs> said. To yeah. Nikhil, every day in the morning with the uh, cup of coffee that never reached to him. But yeah. <laughs> well, you know, maybe you should uh, use your app and get it in some hygienic packaging off the street. Maybe then it'll be. <laughs> <laughs> 